From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Monday, June 24th, 2013 and not fire, but water trouble leading our news. An unidentified man died Sunday afternoon after drowning in a gravel pond in South Fairbanks. Fairbanks Fire and Rescue personnel and Alaska State Troopers got the call around 3 p.m. responding to an area near Lake Lathrop. According to Fairbanks Fire Captain Greg Taylor, the man had been pulling his children in a raft when the bottom gave way. Witnesses at the scene say other swimmers were alerted to the incident and they attempted to find the man but were unsuccessful. Rescue personnel combed the pond for about an hour and also called in a dive team from Fort Wainwright Fire Department. The man's body was recovered from the pond around 4.15 p.m. An investigation into the incident continues. Alaska State Troopers are conducting an investigation after the body of an unidentified man was found floating in the Chena River. According to Trooper Michael Weary, the body was first seen around 3 p.m. by visitors aboard the riverboat Discovery. Troopers say the man was not wearing a flotation device when he was found near Crown Road and Shanks Mare. And Alaska authorities say firefighters from the lower 48 have been flown up from Oregon to Fairbanks to help fight the wildfires. Warm temperatures are expected to continue this week, keeping fire danger high. The Alaska Interagency Coordination Center says vegetation is expected to be very dry and susceptible to new fire starts, especially with thunderstorms expected. Currently, more than 70 wildfires are active in the state. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today it's partly cloudy, isolated thunderstorms in the afternoon with highs in the mid 80s. Tonight mostly cloudy, isolated thunderstorms in the evening, lows in the mid to upper 50s. And then tomorrow partly sunny in the morning, then clearing, highs in the upper 80s. Extended outlook, clouds will come and go, but the heat's going to stay. Upper 80s to low 90s all week long. And that's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. Remember, if you want more news, sports or weather, download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching. Be careful with fire and enjoy the rest of your day.